we're here at the 4x4 exhibit and I'm here with Claire Van to tell us a little bit about this project and this exhibit. I can certainly do that. 4x4 uh, four four represents eight artists. Three of them are from the UK, one is from Germany and four are from the USA. The common denominator for all of us is that we start with plain white undyed cloth. Um, and we're working quite intentionally for that cloth to end up on the wall as art. So we will be putting colour in, taking it out, putting it back in again, using a multitude of surface design techniques. Um, so dyeing, discharging? Dyeing, discharging, fabric paints, gold leaf, whatever. Stamping, washing, scraping screen wow. printing, you name it. Sometimes a piece will have many, many processes, different media and tools used on it. Sometimes a piece like this one will have a very limited number of tools used on it. This is one of my favorite pieces. Um, it's a Traces of Time. It's based on a series. And one of the reasons I love it is because the process of paper lamination allows me to combine my own photographic imagery, paper, with a textile. Um, so that, to me, that makes it doubly possible. The fracturing of the image is all done with a silk screen. Um, it's a very hands-on process. You have to scrub and get down and dirty with it. The other thing I love about this, which you can't truly see here, is when it's lit with light coming onto it, it also creates a shadow on the wall, which adds yet another dimension to the piece. All right, this is Leslie Morgan, and she is an artist that has a piece in the two, well, 2008, right? And the first price is 5,000 pounds, so it's pretty exciting it's over here. And Leslie's going to tell us about her piece and also about this exhibit. This is my piece, which is uh, was joined into this exhibition. It has been an annual exhibition for uh, probably eight years, and um, five jurors select uh, quilts based on excellence, so they get many submissions, and they put them in for some reason of excellence. So this is my piece, which is one of the series, and I'm exploring um, cloth or tall cloth, potentially, or where the cloth is important to the piece. And I'm still quite faithful to my background of quilt making in that I really like altering the surface with stitch. It's not about the loft of being wadded, and as you can see, because they've shown it with the light behind it, you can actually see that the fragility of working this way and, um, and the light shining through the stitch right. it is. So this is actually a double-sided piece, so sometimes it's exhibited so you can walk behind it. And um, so it's got the flip side of, um, of work, yes. Um, on the back. So it's um, the back to me is about no entry and the front is about what you see when you're looking into the voids. You can actually see the shadow of the back as you look through the, um, the light.